adding and subtracting money. Children, let us see how to add or subtract amounts of money. Here I will tell you two methods for adding or subtracting money. In the first method, we convert the given amount of rupees and paise into paise and then add them up as ordinary numbers. Now, convert the sum into rupees. Look at the example shown here. In the second method, we write the money in such a way that paise comes below paise and rupees come below rupees and point below the point. Finally, we add the amounts as we add numbers. Let us take a look at the example shown. For the subtraction of money, we apply the same methods. Let us see some example of both the methods. Children, when we go for shopping, we buy a few number of some items. For example, we may buy 4 packets of chips, 5 bottles of coke and so on. In such a situation, we must know to multiply the cost by the number of items bought. Let us do a problem for this. Find the total cost of 4 packets of chips at rupees 9.5. 5.0 per packet and 5 packets of nuts at rupees 12.25 per packet. So children always remember that if you know the price of one item, you can use multiplication to find out the price of several similar items. Okay children, sometimes during shopping, you know about the price of several similar items and you have to know about price of one item. For this, you can use the division and find out the price of the single item. Let us do a problem for this. Cost of 5 pence is 65 rupees. So find out the cost of one pen.